All right, guys, so today I'm bringing you a video on what a real steering wheel is like versus a fake one. Well, Austin and I went to this place in Connecticut and um, we bought a set of wheels that we thought were real and they were not. Um, honestly, it was pretty hard to tell at first. Like we just saw them all like on display on the wall and they had like the original boxes that you normally would see these products come in, like Nardi, Personal, all that kind of stuff. They had the actual boxes and then they had the wheels themselves, which looked pretty legit. They weren't like NRG quality where you can bend them really easily. Um, but there were some small subtle differences when we looked online later on and realized that we had been kind of on a hoax. Um, we did find these wheels on AliExpress, which was messed up, but that was after we bought them because um, we didn't think that they would be really selling fake wheels, but they were. So I went out to buy this one. This is a Momo Monte Carlo uh, steering wheel. And one of the big factors that you'll see that I show you is like this. This is like nice and tucked and flat down here. And the stitching is really, really, really nice. And quality controlled. I mean, even how it's tucked in here is really nice. <laughs> You also see that real wheels are stamped, made in Italy, with an actual date. Um, this one also came with a leather tag that was got Momo's logo on it, and the box as well. But the box can fool you because they could just buy these boxes. Um, I also have the uh, blue steering wheel button because it matches the blue interior. I mean, it's pretty close. It's a little bit brighter, but it's okay. Compared to the door card, it's still a little brighter, but it's okay. So I've already gone, taken the little cap off, which I don't remember where I put it, but I put it somewhere. I'm gonna take off this 22. I'm gonna swap on the hub that I have, which that, I don't really like energy, but they have hubs, so. I'm gonna go ahead and take this off, and then I'll get right back with you. All right, so I got the majority of it bolted in. Um, it's gonna have to stay like this for now. I didn't have the right Allen key bolts. Didn't come with it for whatever reason, but um, I need a spacer. So I got the energy hub, right? So this needs a spacer because I cannot fit my hand in here if it were fully tightened. So that's okay. Got the horn to work, looks really good. Um, like I said, when you look at a real steering wheel, look at all these nice stitchings and everything. See how nice that looks, how nice and tucked this is. Like I said, the made in Italy in the back. Momo's like perfectly centered. This apparently is not. I don't know if I can rotate that, I'll do that later. Um, that's pretty much it, guys. Just make sure when you go to buy steering wheels that you don't get messed up, because it could be expensive. Especially because that shop was selling AliExpress uh, steering wheels and seats, unfortunately. Um, so just be careful of that, guys. Even though they're local and stuff like that, doesn't mean they're always good. So enjoy the next clip because it's all about the fake wheel itself. Um, yeah, there's a fake accent. Whatever. Like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for more content. Peace. What's up, you fucking assholes? <laughs> I want to show you what the fuck a fake wheel looks like, okay? Well, I'll be an asshole. I'll be an asshole and sell this. You see this? Hold part? on a second. Your fucking screen is dead. All right, much better. I'm fucking sorry. See this fucking sparkle? You think this is a fucking real wheel? I can't wheel? fucking see it. Look at the fucking sparkle. Okay. We'll fucking sparkle. Look at this fucking, look at this fucking gabagoo, okay? Look at this fucking shit. Sparkle. www.sparkle.it Fucking attitude racing with whatever. Racing attitude. Style sparkle. You fucking think this is a real fucking box. What's this even say? Spazio, Concia, but I don't know how to say that. I I'm sorry. I think it's on a fucking guinea. I don't fucking know. I'm sorry, I'm an asshole. But I'm gonna tell you this right now. I'm being an asshole. Just because you want to support local business. Ow, you're an asshole. asshole. That hurt. Don't be an asshole. I'm sorry. I'm an asshole. 
But you see this here. Look at this fucking stitching. Look at this. They didn't fucking cut the That's excess off. fucking guinea quality right there. Look at this. They even fucking make it nice. They even, this is not even stamped on the back. Look at this fucking button. Look at this fucking button. You can't even take it out because I didn't take the fucking bolts out. I'm sorry. I'm not going to do that. We're trying to return this tomorrow. Look at all this fucking stitching. Huh? Now look at the fucking stitching. Fucking tragic. Okay? I'm not happy about this. I wasted $250 for this garbage. I asked, is it real? They said, you know what they said to me? They said, I believe it's real. I'm not so sure. I asked them about their seats. You know what they said about their seats? Nah, they ain't real. Because he didn't even know. And I know that they're not real. Because Recaros do not cost a thousand fucking dollars. But anyways. That's relatively inexpensive. Yeah, that's too inexpensive for what we were trying to buy. I wanted to buy one seat. Figured it'd be $800 for one seat. I was wrong. It was 900 for two. They wouldn't sell me just one. Then I found out they were fake. Well, what little did I know, we spent $250 on an Alibaba steering wheel, okay? Not good. Not good. Doesn't even have Sparkle stamp down here. I didn't know what the hell I was looking at. I wasted my time, my energy. I was trying to support local business. My man here, my man, my man here got busted up. This wise guy right here got busted up. He thought he got OMP. Nah, he got OMG. It was not OMP. So I'm going to tell you this. Be a real wise, guys. Don't fucking buy it. Do your fucking research. So you research. Don't just buy it just because you think $250 is a good deal. You're saving 20 bucks. Well, I'll tell you this right now. If I put this on here, this shit. Look at that. It just fucking it didn't even bend. It was just the fucking shit in the back. Don't worry about that. <laughs> the whole premise You're is. fucking asshole. The real fucking premise here is. If you fucking buy this shit, just make sure you fucking buy it online from the source. Because honestly... I bought the fucking real one not even 20 minutes ago. You know what I fucking paid? I paid $220 because it was on sale from fucking Momo. Yeah, that's right. I said fuck Sparkle because I don't want to remember this experience. I fucking said, let me buy the Momo one. I bought the Momo one that he wanted, that wise guy. He wanted the fucking Momo one. I said, no, I'm buying the Momo one because I got blue interior. So I'm going to go back to the fucking store and buy the Wo Wo one. You buy the Wo Wo one. You'll be disappointed just like we are. Don't be, don't be dumb. We'll don't buy be the a fucking, fucking wise guys. Get your biscuits guy. right. Get your fucking biscuits right. He's got. Look at this guy. He's speaking facts. Nothing but facts. Don't ever waste your money on local stuff. It's not worth it. There's nothing in Connecticut that will get you anything that you want. It is garbage here. You ain't going to fucking Summit. You don't got Summit in Connecticut. It ain't fucking real. Don't fucking go there. Jags. We ain't got Jags in Connecticut. Don't fucking go there. Sparkle. Clearly, we ain't got that fucking shit here. So don't be a wise guy. Or be a wise guy. Like, don't buy fucking fake shit. Or else we're going to try to get our fucking money back. We'll tell you how it goes tomorrow. If not, I'm going to post this to YouTube instead of just Facebook. And we're going to try to fucking go marketing. Go global. What the fuck is this bullshit? Do you think they rivet these there from factory? I don't fucking think so. I don't so. fucking think so. Now that I'm looking at it, your shit doesn't even say fucking sparkle anywhere on the fucking stand. Yeah, there's wheel. no fucking way this shit says sparkle. Look, 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 look right asshole. here. It says fucking asshole. Oh, look at this fucking asshole. I'm going to fucking put that shit in the gif. Yeah, be a wise guy. Look, oh, fuck. I didn't even see that. Look at the fucking stitching. It's coming Some out. Some of the, the stitching loop. looks like dog shit. I'm not going to lie. Even on the real fucking... ones. But it doesn't say fucking sparkle anywhere. We should I'm fucking so dissect it tonight. We should fucking dissect it, but I don't want to lose $250 if I don't have to, so, you know. They're going to get fucking store credit, and they're going to tell you. If I get store credit, we're buying all their hot wheels there. That's it. It's over. They then got I'm going to fucking wheels. scalp them and buy the fucking cold wheels. That is it. That is all fucking I want to keep assholes. people on today. You fucking wise guys. You need to this learn. Minute is, this is fucking five minutes long. Sum it up fucking wise guys do your research make sure you don't buy fucking fake steering wheels and honestly if you want a fucking fake steering wheel go pay fucking forty dollars don't go pay no fucking 270 yeah, dollars that's don't, fucking ridiculous this is fucking stupid i thought i was gonna be driving this it's fucking, a fucking car. load of garbage look at this shit i thought i was gonna be nice and comfy driving with this fucking wheel every time i look at it i just fucking think it's a disgrace i don't fucking want it. i'm fucking furious. i'm fucking pissed